Sure, you've most likely heard of clout chasing in the modern era, but did you know that it has existed for far longer than you've probably assumed? Take for example, Herostratus, the man who burnt down an enormous temple literally so that we would talk about him. So yeah, I guess it worked. But what exactly happened and what led him to burning down the second temple of Artemis in Ephesus? The temple itself was thought to be in use since the Bronze Age and was a building of considerable importance within the ancient world. So much so that it was named as being a now ancient wonder of the world by Herodotus, the ancient historian, and was also considerably large, measuring at 337 by 180 feet with decorated pillars that stretched up to 40 feet in height, all of which surrounded the statue of Artemis. But who was Herostratus? Well, other than the obvious, we don't really know. He was a Greek man, presumed to be of lower status, potentially even a slave. But that's really it. So what do you do as a low status Greek man, who wants to be one of the chosen few who will be remembered thousands of years into the future? Well, one way to do it is by burning down that temple everybody keeps talking about, which coincidentally is exactly what Herostratus did. Wanting to have his name known indefinitely, he took fire to the temple of Artemis, burning the building's wood attributes to the ground. And of course, after hearing why he did this, the Greeks sentenced him to death and the punishment of condemnation of memory, making it illegal to talk about and record his actions. But well, as you are clearly watching this video, who really won that exchange? Herostratus' name has actually become so popular that there's a modern term named after him. And well, his actions. Herostratic fame is the name for an individual pursuing fame at any cost, often by criminal actions. Oh. And if you want to see some ruins of the temple, of course, the British Museum has you covered. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, consider liking and subscribing for future content.